I will try and make a presentation in under three minutes, but without going at breakneck speed. I'll do my best. Again, as Albert was saying, I'm at the Puig de las Cadiretas School. This is a high complexity school. We used to be a top complexity school, but now we are high with an extended um, hours. And our project is extending our tools because we have located, we have incorporated new tools, new tech tools that would help us in providing this innovation that we have in our school. In order to work on this project, we have based ourselves on two notions. First, the cross-cutting nature. It must be present everywhere. It's not just what you do there on with that teacher on that hour in that classroom. No, it must be available in all at all hours in all areas. Secondly, it must be universal for all students. As my peers here mentioned, it must be an integrational tool. It must include all students. And again, we incorporated all these tools, complementing and extending what we had before. We are not just ruling out the dictionary, the compass. We just want to go beyond because these new technologies provide us with a series of skills, competences, uh, profit and benefits, uh, uh, even though people may not like this word, but yet are essential in the 21st centuries. For instance, in troubleshooting, when in problem breakdown, so that they can break down problems into smaller parts, or pattern recognition, wouldn't that be incorporated into different uh, process or cooperation? Um, peer learning or motivation or ubiquitousness, ubiquity. So when you provide them with these tools, uh, it really makes a difference. Mobile learning, at preschool, we have created an area where they have a desktop computer. Yes, there are still some desktop computers as well as a tablet where they can practice a series of strategies. And for primary school, we have a couple of tablets for every two years and they have a given timetable but again it can be stretched it can it's flexible enough you can pick it if you require it and then we have an app directory so that profes the teachers may that may not know enough about it they can see that in a list where we have used toolbox as a source for recommendations I would suggest you taking a look at it in case you didn't know it. And I really like this picture here, in that we don't leave abacuses behind. Our abacus are still with us, but then along with the tablet. Uh, on robotics and on coding, these are the robots we use uh, on preschool, but down to the sixth grade of primary, and then what programs and tools, such as Robot Turtles, for instance, which is indeed a board game, that we use for coding skills. This is all possible, not just because we have a great staff, because of Llagostera 3.0, which is a project started at the City Council of Llagostera, that other than these type of tools, it also provides education and training for the whole citizenship and a site for education for the whole citizen so that you can attend together with your kids and so that you can manage and learn what they are doing at school. That's it. Hope I...